Good morning, Todd. Oh, uh, hey, Mauricia. It's really nice to see you. Um, thanks. <laughs> oh, good morning, 344 South Fairview. Mr. K, I have a problem with Mauricia. Sorry, 344. I don't do problems anymore. That's Dr. Dana's job. Dr. who? Got problems? I don't care. But Dr. Dana does. Wayside's radio advice problem solver on the PA. Hello, listeners, and welcome to the Dr. Dana Show. Broadcasting live, high atop Wayside. And I'm here to help solve your problems. And I'm here to help Dana. Myron, thanks. But I don't need your help right now. You can stay, but you have to be quiet. So let's... Okie dokie. <sighs> so let's get started. Caller one, you're on the air. Yes, Dr. Data, I feel like people never get to know the real me. All they ever see are my feet. Caller one, your toes have a tail to tell. Learn to express yourself more through your feet. Well, that's a great idea, thanks. Problem solved. Oh, good answer, good answer. Can I help now? Myron. Shh. Okay, next. So sorry. Next caller. Dr. Dana, there's this boy. Let's call him Todd. I like him, but I'm not sure if he likes me. Do you ever show him you like him? Oh, yes. I hit him all the time. Hmm, you hit him. Right in the shoulder. I've seen her. <laughs> Men are hunters. If you hunt them, they won't be interested. Let him come to you. So I should avoid him. Then Todd, <gasps> uh, I mean, Todd, will come to me? Absolutely. Give him lots of space. He'll miss your pretty face. Of course, it rhymes. It must work. Problem solved. Next caller. Uh, uh, am I on the air? Yep, this is Dr. Dana and we're on the air. Dr. Dana, now that you're solving all those snot-nosed brats problems, I have nothing to do. Maybe you should take up a hobby. Really? How do you do that? Just pick your favorite thing that you like to do and do it. But what if you have two favorite things? Then do both. Problem solved. That's it. I'll do my two favorite things. Stamp collecting and cooking. Don't worry. It's happened to all of us. You just need to remember. Shampoo, rinse, then conditioner. Look, Dana, no hands! <laughs> Mauricia's giving me a lot of space. Gee, I miss her pretty face. Hey, Mauricia, wait, there's an empty seat here. Thank you, Dr. Dana. And my advice to you would be to go with a mixture of Kentucky bluegrass and fine fescue. Dude, I, I mean, Doc, thanks for helping me fix the school lawn. Are you okay? No, I get it. You're all out of advice. Thank goodness I'm here to help you out. Hello, listeners. The doctor is in the house. Dana, you can stay, but you have to be quiet. So until the doctor cures her laryngitis, she wants me to fill in for her. So let's solve those problems. Next caller. Hi, Doc D. Uh, Myron. I was just wondering, which is more important, spiritual freedom or physical freedom? Um. Oh, all freedom is uh important, and to best experience it, you should place a basket over your head. A basket over my head? That's what Doctor Dana says. Problem solved. Well, if Dr. Dana says so. Next caller. When is Halloween this year? Mm, February 2nd. I thought that was Groundhog's Day. What? They combined Halloween with Groundhog's Day? 
Oh, Dr. Dana says it's all the same. So get yourself the closest groundhog and start celebrating. Um, how about a porcupine? Even better, Doc Dana says happy Hollow Hog Day to you. Problem solved. Next caller. What are you doing? Dr. Dana says stop, Dana. Yeah, Dana. Leave Dr. Dana alone. Dana's acting kind of funny. Should we take her to the nurse's office or something? Problem solved. Next caller. <laughs> ah, p -p -p this hobby business is a complete disaster. Uh, Dr. Dana? Dr. Dana, you're on the air. Oh, these hobbies aren't working out. What should I do with my free time now? I know. Dr. Dana says you should... Ask Miss Mush to marry you. Hmm, marriage. Never tried that before. But it might be fun! Gotta get you to the nurse. <laughs> ah! Hmm, not bad, but your toe tails need more action. Can you add a wrestling scene? <laughs> Dr. Dana says, more, more, more! <laughs> yeah! Problem solved! Hey, Miss Mush, we need the school nurse. Aha, uh -huh. no problem! Hmm, what's wrong with her? Tell her, Dana. <laughs> oh, she lose voice. I fix. I just need few ingredients. I be back. <laughs> Dr. Dana, should I go to France or Fiji? Neither. Dr. Dana says it's time to fulfill your dream of being a trapeze artist. Problem solved. Oh, that sounds like a wonderful idea. I hope you're right, Dr. Dana! Dana, what have you done? Ah! Dr. Dana now says I should start hitting Todd again. Harder! Daddy, look out! Your advice stinks, Dr. D. <laughs> Special fiction stew ready! It clear throat. Voice come back. Miss Mush, you are so... <laughs> well, you're cooking. Now that's... <laughs> Not much there either. Hey, I know! Miss Mush, you are so great with the whatchamacallits. Wait, I can't stand those little people. We have nothing in common. Hey, Kidski, what here are you for? I do not want to marry you. I don't want to marry you either. Oh, you want to eat now? says, problem solved. Next caller. Okay, do your stuff, stop. Dr. Dana says, enough with the Dr. Dana. Wow, you can speak. Yes, and this is what I have to say. The Dr. Dana show has officially been canceled. Please ignore any advice you have received. And just think for yourself, people. Thank goodness that's over with. This hobby stuff is taking up all my free time. Better get back to work. What? The show's canceled? You can't do that. I'm going to help, and nothing's going to stop me! Uh-oh. Class, what's wrong with Myron? 
lost his voice yelling, but he asked me to speak for him. And Myron says he'd like to demonstrate his trapeze skills. Oh, he can borrow mine. Myron also says he needs a little help here. Hmm, let's see. Oh, yeah, Myron says he'd like to express himself more. While wearing a basket on his head. Happy Hollow Hob Day! <laughs> now that's a problem solved. <laughs>